goes. Right, as you can see I've made up the power board, the charger board. I've looped all the paws and all the leg on the inputs. And the reason I've got the cables coming out of the middle is because I wanted the balanced input going through so as not to upset the settings coming out. Um, I've got four 6 amp um, Shockley diodes on the positives and then obviously the negatives coming out as well. Now what we shall be doing once the charge is free, it's got 40 milliamps to go on this uh, cell, we will then put it on the two inputs and we will set these up to 4 volts each at this point so that we've got exactly 4, point, 4 volts coming out. Um, we may need to readjust it once the relays are here to allow for um, resistance on, on the contacts which ain't going to be a great deal so whatever I set it up here uh, minus the 0.6 on the diodes I showed you yesterday um, will be fine. So there we are all set and the next thing is to set all these to 4 volts with um, 12 volt input. Okay, that's what we're uh, trying to achieve. 5 volts output and I'm putting in 12 volts. Um, I did a test on the first one I did. I set it up to uh, 5 volts at 12 volts then I wound the power supply up to 18 volts and 5 volts stayed exactly where it, where it is which is exactly what we're looking for. Right, and this is how I did it.